long protocol observed. And I believe we have some traditional authority in our midst. And I greet you, uh, Mofa Department. I really greet you and um, say a very big thank you for your continued support. Um, we have here various partners, MIDA, um, that is an uh, ally in uh, promoting the, the cost of women in agriculture, particularly in soya and granite value chain. And um, we are grateful for your partnership, MIDA. Then we have the various partners here. The theme for this 2023 season lunch is um, right input, right time, and right application. Um, interestingly, I think three days ago, uh, we were in um, Sisala, East and West, and um, so I visited my friend who is the co of GFC. And he said, oh, Elon, if you had consulted me on the scene, I would have added one more R. So it would have been the four R's. And that would have been right input, right time, right application, equals to right results. So uh, consider that we have actually added one more R here because uh, there's no point to all of the R's without the right results. Our biggest quest is to enable productivity for the farmer. Abisov is excited to be hosting the Novel Farming Season Lunch for 2023. This is because we have always wanted the best for the farmers and to make sure the farmers stand on the right foundation. Everyone present here today must be proud for being part of supporting a good cause that is getting farmers ready for a new season. Therefore, it is not surprising that our theme to launch this 2023 season is that right input, right time, right application, the three hours. But this time round is the four hours, equals to right result. You would agree with me that agricultural production is full of uncertainty. And farmers are the worst affected due to vulnerabilities that they are exposed to. This therefore makes sense that farmers are prepared in readiness for every farming season. In order to succeed, farmers need access to inputs, need access to information, and need access to the right way of application in order to derive the best outcome. And this is what I resolve and we connect is most proud of that we have established the Green Connect centers and there are about 20 of them scattered around the five northern regions and uh, we are presenting that access to inputs, access to markets, access to information, all the accesses farmers need to thrive. The launch will reach over 10,000 farmers in the project locations. The activity will reach all categories of farmers, and particularly young people and women. And other value chain access from MOFA, input suppliers in private sector, and uh, those here are particularly partners of media. The launch activity will be clustered in 12 project areas. They include Samale, Salaga, Yendi, Tumu, Zini, Gropie, Fumbisi, JPC, Sangpala, Tofu, Funsi, Bushegu, and Sang. And um, I'm happy to state 
guys, this is um, our fifth main event and um, our last under the main uh, sentence. Currently, we have um, ongoing events in Gushegu as well. I think the last of the minor events is in JPC on the 14th. Avisol presents that access to input, that access to market, that access to technology and mechanization. And like I have said over and over again, these are just what farmers need to thrive. I see a lot more women here and uh, I'm always glad to see, you know, women, my fellow farmers, my fellow value chain players. And, uh, and that's because Agrisolve is an, a woman-led organization. And so I can say, and uh, sorry to you men, that um, unfortunately, or fortunately for us, we are very women by us. So there are so many programs that are extremely women-centered from our in-growers team and then to our entrepreneurial development where we are urging women to get out of their shelves and be proactive and be proper business people. So this year, we would be grooming thousand women, taking them out of their communities towards or positioning them towards better prosperity. We would forge ahead to re formalize their business by registering their businesses. And we would also take them through good training and, and men mentorship. And um, hopefully by the close of this year, thousand smallholder farmers or women and uh, entrepreneurs would have emerged from our women program and that is not all and um, the idea is also that they are capable or they are enabled to actually do business within their communities over here there's always a um, various streets in maize and soya and um, that's a market platform we mainly give and so we want this woman to go into their communities, mobilize whatever there is in view of any of the products that we engage in and bring to our centers. So invariably, they become partners of AgriSol. I think we've all been sitting here for so long and uh, I wouldn't want to bore you further um, all I want to conclude with is that uh, AgriSolve is here for farmers. We are with farmers and uh, whatever it takes, we would want prosperity of the farmers that they are able to feed their families, they are able to afford education for their children and health care as well. That, Communities grow because of farmers' association with AgriSolve or Green Connect. Um, and I'd like to thank Mofa again for accepting us wholly. I mean, there's nothing we do that they do not represent fully. And uh, they are partners through and through. Director, thank you very much. You are well appreciated. I wish us all the best. Um, I wish us a bountiful season and uh, may prosperity reign. Thank you.